Okay, for number 17, I'm gonna need to get these two to the left-hand side. So I'm first gonna subtract the x squared, which is just a one x squared. And on the left side, the term that I can combine that x squared with is this one, because this one also has an x squared. So I'm gonna subtract a one x squared here. So a two x squared minus a one x squared is just a one x squared, or just an x squared. And then I'm left with a negative x. To get that negative x to the left side, I'm gonna add one x. The term that I can combine that one x with is this middle term. And so I have an x squared and then a negative nine x plus a one x and then a negative eight x and then minus a 65 is equal to zero. So now um, the coefficient of x squared is one. So I'm gonna use the box method. Split up your x squared evenly. Two numbers when multiplied together equal negative 65, but when added together equal negative eight. So I'm gonna use my calculator. Um, it looks like it's gonna be five and 13, but it's gonna be a negative 13 times a five is a negative 65 and a negative 13 plus a five is a negative eight. So one of your binomials is x minus 13 and the other is x plus five. Hopefully you can just see the answer from this because remember it's the opposite of what it looks like. However, if you can't, what you could do to check is you can take the x minus 13 and set it equal to zero and then solve for x by adding 13 to both sides and we would get x is 13 and then I could take the x plus five and set it equal to zero and subtract five from both sides to get x by itself and I get x is equal to negative five. So these are your two answers for that.